I auditioned Canada, I think, three times, and finally, actually on the third time, he didn't give it to me yet. He said, you know, great job. I think I was there at that point, but then I got called on the set a couple times uh, just to kind of work, walk around, do boot camp, and then he finally told me I got the role, so. And that was like a couple weeks before we started shooting, so. I mean, that was such a weird moment because he's someone I look up to so much. Like, his films are, I think, he's one of the greatest directors alive today and working with him is just so phenomenal and having him being proud of what I'm doing is just such it's such a good feeling the relationship between Hawk and Glass is really one of kind of quiet respect it's real like there's there's a silent connection between them it's not really there's definitely that deep love and care for each other, but living in this time period, you can't, you can't be soft. So it's definitely like a hard love. If you're not gonna do the scene right, he's gonna let you know, which I, I respect the hell out of him, because he's gonna get what he wants. And I think he's one of the most um, respectable directors out there because he's so good at what he does and he can see like in his head exactly what he wants and he can tell in an instant if you're not being truthful. So <clears throat> I guess he just brings complete truth into film. Hello, Valerie here with a cool movie fact. Josh Hutcherson read the entire Hunger Games trilogy in five days to prepare for his role as Peter. For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. See you!